Okay, so I'm in our horse barn. I'm trying to get where there's a little bit more light on my face. There we go. So I'm in our horse barn right now. I was getting some things prepared for tomorrow. So we're kind of starting the weekend early. It's Wednesday night. Tomorrow is 4th of July. We're going out and then we're going to have a good afternoon as well. And then we'll have to work Friday and then the weekend will start. So anyways, whatever. But yeah, I prepared stuff. So I'm just putting it in our outdoor fridge at the barn. So in the morning, get done feeding. We can just grab it, put it in the truck and go. So I'll show you what I prepared. In our house, I prepared like, or got all the crackers together, stuff like that. And our cooler and our bags, beach bag, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, but here is this. So I have two ranches, or two ranches of ketchup. And then I have this. Then we're gonna pack two of these, along with, I always bring a water bottle pre-filled with like water in it and ice. And then I'm gonna bring some salt and pepper shakers. Ah. So yeah. That's what we got and these I'm giving to the pigs, so just ignore that. But yeah, so I'm super excited. Come and see it. Setting the puppies up before we go on the water today. Happy 4th of July. Yeah. Hello, little puppies. Good morning, everyone. Happy 4th of July. P.S. Macy, Evie, Emery, and Fletcher. If you're watching this, we love you. We are headed out for 4th of July. We are decked out in our blues and whites and reds. But yeah, even have our eyes blue. Not just kidding. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. You guys, I made me a chai today. It's super easy and it's decaffeinated. I was so excited when I found it. I don't remember the brand, I'll have to tell you. But you just literally pour half of that in there and then half milk of your choice and you're ready to go. And it tastes just like the chai you get at like Starbucks or, you know, one of your local places. But, yeah, so. Anyways, we're going on the boat today. Where are we going exactly? Like, it, it's like beachy, right? Yeah, we're going to like a, it's like definitely salt water for sure. And then we're going to find a little beach spot and then park and hang out. So, that's the plans for today. I'll see you guys soon. Okay, we made it to Austin's mom and dad's. We're gonna grab, we put all of our stuff in here. We're gonna grab a little snack or like breakfast and then we're headed out. So let's go. Breakfast, so we have Nutella and bread and then some homemade pizza. So delicious. It's ranch base with a little bit of hot sauce and then cheese and chicken, so good. We got back and we showered at Austin's mom and dad's and now we're headed to our house and we're 
we're gonna get ready for the night and check on our dogs and meet up with my parents. So that's the plans for now. Currently <clears throat> feeding horses. Fireworks are going off. officially Friday evening so tonight's gonna be super fun I worked today did four dogs but tonight we're going to Austin's mom and dad to have Christmas in July we are gonna have like breakfast for dinner and then watch movies I'm very excited so I'm gonna get dressed let's go all right I grabbed our stuff put it in a duffel bag headed out to our horse barn because that's where Austin is and then we're gonna leave and head over there so tonight we plan on taking a shower and I have like Christmassy looking pajamas and stuff. Because like I said, we're going to have like the Christmas movie night. And I've already taken one, but it's just so hot that like, I know we'll have to about at night. It's like you walk outside and you're drenched. So yeah, let's go. Okay, I sort of combed through this one and now I'm going to do this one, but I wanted y'all to see the difference. Okay, it's my eyelashes. Love it. You guys, I love this brand. And this chocolate with raspberry is so good. I don't really love raspberries, but mixed with chocolate I do because it's like not too sweet, not too sour, and it's perfect. And for Marshalls, five bucks. I recommend. This looks like high class fancy chocolate when you lay it out because it's these huge slabs of it. So, recommend. Christmas in July. <laughs> Hi guys, so this morning we I had stayed last night at Austin's mom and dad's. We had a great night. Then we woke up, showered, come home. Austin, I had a bad sinus headache, so Austin fed for me while I tried to rest some and then went to a baby shower for someone that I grew up with. And then after that now, I've changed. I had like a cute little dress on and my sunburn from 4th of July is brutal, you guys. Like it's hurting so bad. So always make sure you put your sunscreen on and especially if you're going to be on like water or something, you definitely need like 100 SPF because you're still going to get sun even with 100 SPF. But anyways, so yeah, that was fun. And now I'm going to go to our boutique and work a little bit. We're closed this weekend for 4th of July and we've been working on some things in the boutique. But yeah, got me a little top on with this little blouse. And I'm using this little purse that my friend gave me for her mom and her gave it to me for um, getting married and stuff to take on my honeymoon, which I did, but it's like the cutest thing ever. And yeah, I've just got on some cute little jewelry and things from our boutique. And I have on this little ring I got on a cruise that my mom and dad got me. And of course, the rings from the hubby. But yeah, anyways, I'm gonna stop blabbering. I just wanted to update you guys. P.S. tonight, I think we are going out uh, to eat at town or either I don't know I do think we're going to town for sure though Austin had somewhere he wanted to go but I think we're gonna go there and then either come back home and eat or eat out I'm not sure yet so we'll see what happens PS my hair I'm loving the length of it right now I I kind of so when we cut my hair short I cut it kind of like a bob type style where it's a little short in the back longer in the front and I like that but I realized that I don't love it and I next time I get my hair cut we're probably I don't know if it'll be next it'll either be next time or the next when it's grown a little bit more because we will have to cut off a little bit of length to get it there I'll probably just let it grow out and then cut the front when it's gotten a little bit longer but anyways I want to get it more where it's the same length all the way around because it's hard for me I think it, like I said if I wouldn't have cut it like in a bob style and left it the same all the way around I think I would have liked it a little better, but it was really hard for me to like straighten the back because of how much shorter this was than like the front. And it was short, that's just in general. But anyways, so I do love the length of my hair. And I like, short hair is like, you've always got to fix it. But once it gets, now I can wear it in a clip and stuff. And it's like, I want to look presentable everywhere I go. And so then if it's in a clip and it looks cute and my hair looks nice in the front, it you still look put together. But when mine was so short, I couldn't hardly, and I didn't like it. So at least I tried it though. But I do, I, I've liked this length though, cause I can put it in like a little clip. But I think I wanna get it just not long. I want it like a very healthy, 
length obviously but I want to get it to like maybe here or here I think I want it here or maybe here just like kind of a healthy length where I can it's still not if I'm running late I can still fix it without it taking me forever and then also if I need to put it up it looks better because it's longer you have a little more hair so yeah sorry about my rambling but anyways that's my tidbit short hair you can still do it even if you don't fix it like it you can still make it work but short hair you do have to fix and I liked it because it forces you to fix it but then in those moments where you run late and you don't have time it's like so but anyways my hair I like it today I thought it looked really cute but yeah hey you guys so we are headed to town we are going to go to the Disney store and then to eat soon tell you why I'm going to the Disney store but I can't really tell you yet because that wouldn't be any fun but yeah it's been a good day we're gonna go do that and then come home and feed because it is just so hot for the horses that I want to wait and feed them when it's cooled off All right, we just got home and fed the horses. We fed the horses late because you got, I don't know if I told you guys earlier, but it was just so, so, so hot. It was like index today, heat index. It was like 99 degrees outside and then it was like 110 heat index. So it was very hot. So we wanted to feed them. When you feed them late like this, they can really enjoy it and it's not hot, it's cooled off, it's dark outside and I think they just enjoy it way better. So it's like try to feed them early in the morning and then late in the afternoon. So, morning vlog. It's Sunday morning and we're feeding before church. Doc. Hi, Doc. Gus. And then Noble is with Austin on the other side of the farm feeding the other horses. And then Howdy's inside. Moved him to an outside stall because it's just so hot. The ventilation out here is really good. So yeah, we're feeding this morning and we're gonna get ready for church and have a great day and then eat lunch with my family. I'm so excited for that. So let's do it. Come here. Noble, can you sit? Sit. That's a good boy. You hot? You hot, Noble? <gasps> yeah. I wish it was fall with the leaves falling like they are. What are you doing? Noble. No. Oh, it fell. It hit the ground. No, it hit the ground, buddy. He had the zoomies a second ago. Don't touch the wire. No. Come on. Try to get through. Think. Come on. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. Use your brain. Come on. Come on. Oh, under here. There you go. Sit. Good boy. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm ready for church. This is what I'm wearing. This new shirt I got yesterday with a little skirt. And I have my cute little purse my bestie gave me. So it was a great Sunday. We just got home, but we were letting one of our dogs out really quick. But I just wanted to hop on and say hello. God is so good. And I just wanted to tell y'all that a lot of times in life, we get so busy, we get so strung out. And the real purpose of life is to love Jesus and spread his word and his love with others. So hopefully, Lord willing, if they open their heart, they can see God. And yeah, we can all go to heaven together. But Anyways, I just want to say I love y'all, had a great day, and I'll see you next time.